Many of you have seen articles about the Earth's inner core switching direction. Now, this is nothing more really than clickbait and a very poor explanation of what's actually going on. Here we can see from IFL Science, Earth's spinning inner core recently paused, then flipped its direction. This isn't actually what's happening. And we'll explain it in just a moment. But here's the paper. Multi-decadal variation of Earth's inner core rotation. Now what actually happens, <laughs> and we'll get to that, and we'll break it down, but in a report published in Nature Geoscience this week, seismologist Ziadong Song and Yi Yang of Peking University in China said that the Earth's iron core slowed its rotation in 2009, and it briefly then fell in sync with the planet's overall rotation during this time. Then, the seismologists say that the core turned in an opposite direction. But this is not what happened. It just slowed slower than the rotation of Earth, so it's a retrograde motion. Let me explain that. The Earth's inner core was, had a super rotation, meaning it was spinning faster than the Earth was spinning prior to 2009. Around 2009, the spin of the inner core matched the spin of the Earth. And then after that, it slowed to a point where it appears as if the inner core is moving in retrograde motion. It's still spinning in the same direction. It hasn't changed direction. It has changed direction relative to the crust only. Does that make sense? We'll show you the data. It, so this is not a very significant phenomenon. Sometimes here is 2010. Sometimes the inner core spins slower than the Earth. Sometimes it spins a little faster than the Earth. And it's just a little bit faster or a little bit slower. So here it's spinning faster than the Earth is spinning, and then it switched. And then it's spinning slower, for the most part, than the Earth. But not really. Here we have data in 2020 where the core is spinning faster than the crust. So it's, not, it's just a small variation. And in fact, the team says that this fluctuation of faster and slower inner core variations occurs over about 70 years. And this is the paper. We'll leave you links below for all of this information. So all that's happening is the inner core is either spinning faster than the Earth or, or less, a little slower than the Earth. It's not reversing direction. It's always spinning in the direction of the Earth. And what does that mean for us? Well, the only real effect, now that the core is spinning slower than the crust, it may lead to slightly shorter days. And that's exactly what we have seen here. We're over at time and date. And we can see today's predicted to be a faster than 24 hours. But overall, on average, the mean solar day in the last 365 days was 0.25 milliseconds under 24 hours, meaning the Earth is slowing relative to the average, which is what they predicted in the paper. Nothing catastrophic whatsoever. Now, the big question and because they're studying this now, is what actually is happening in the inner core? Is the inner and outer core solid, iron, and liquid? Or is that just a fairy tale? And how has the inside of the Earth stayed as hot as the sun's surface for billions of years? Shouldn't it have cooled? Something is going on in the center of the Earth. Well, in my opinion, that's unexplained. And that's a boom to knowledge. Share this with like-minded people. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Give us a thumbs up. Become a Patreon. Support the work we do. We love you. Be safe.